Okay, hello everyone. I'm running late. It's the day of my first tutorial. Um, enter as guest. That's yeah, that's what I want to do. Okay, I'm about to click enter room. I've got one minute until it starts, so I'm just in time. I feel like I'm running late for lectures again. <laughs> Hi, yeah, can you hear me? Okay, so it is time to take a break. It is 10.40. The session started at nine, so I've done an hour and 40 minutes. We have this tutor who is so, so friendly. Actually, I haven't even given you guys a background to this. So these tutorials are run by ACTED, the actuarial education company. They are basically lessons on the content of the IFOA syllabus for the actuarial exams. Usually you'd have the option to go to in-person tutorials, but given the current circumstances, all the tutorials are online. It's kind of a chat room thing where there's 15 of us in the class and we've got a little chat box where we can send in questions. They can either be seen by the whole group or just privately to our tutor and then we have to work on a question from a handout and then type in our answer and she'll give feedback. And then there's a whiteboard thing that she's writing on and talking us through the content. It's a good setup and clearly the tutor has lots of experience at this. The only thing I'm finding is that it's it's very slow. I might eat my words later on when suddenly we get to the more advanced stuff. This is just a morning tutorial, so it's actually going to finish at 12.30. There's various options with tutorials, whether you just want to have four days in one go or four days spread out over a few months or eight mornings spread out over a few months. And that's what I've gone for. Anyway, we are having a 10 minute break, so I'm gonna grab myself a coffee and a biscuit and then reconvene. Right, that's my first tutorial done. Do you know, it was useful because we got a lot of tips on common mistakes in exams and the places where questions can really catch you out. I think it's very valuable to speak to someone who is so familiar with the exam format and knows exactly how the questions are structured. It's all very well knowing the content, but if you don't have the exam technique and the correct way of approaching the questions and knowing what you need to write down to get marks, you just won't get the marks. So. In that respect, I think that tutorial was really useful. Interesting thing that the tutor did say at the end of the tutorial is that it's possible that exams might stay online forever because in this coming exam sitting in April, all the exams are going to be online because of the pandemic. But so far they found that online exams have run quite smoothly. It's so much cheaper for them to have the exams online. And if they're effective and assess people correctly, then why wouldn't they keep them that way? But I just hate that thought. Imagine having all of them online. My problem is, right, typing out equations is just not the one. I want to be able to write out an integral using pen and paper. I do not want to be typing out integrals in Microsoft Word. You can add formulae in Microsoft Word, but it is a slow process. <sighs> It just, it adds to my worries that everything's going to be online going forward, even like separate from this, my work. I just want to be in an office. The world is changing. There's this new normal where we might just be all working from home forever. Like it's so much cheaper for companies to have everyone working from home. What is this? I think my parcel is arriving. I'm going to go grab the door. Oh, 
Oh, this is exciting. This, I'll show you what it is in a sec. Right, this, I think, actually, is it what I think it is? Yeah. It is my tables, formulae and tables for examinations of the Institute and Faculty of Actuaries. That's quite exciting. I was not expecting a nice book like this. It's like proper hardback. Wow. Oh. I like the smell of fresh books. This afternoon, I am not going to study because I've got a couple of client calls scheduled, which I'm taking meeting notes for. So I've decided to move my half day of study that I've got remaining for this week to Thursday. And I'll speak to you guys on Thursday. Ooh, time travel, welcome to Thursday. The goal of this afternoon is to get myself prepared for my tutorial next week. I cannot even remember what I need to cover. Possibly joint distribution? Joint distributions, conditional expectation. I've powered my computer off so people can't message me this afternoon. <laughs> Although I might turn it back on at four. There's like a whole team feedback meeting and it's very short. I'm not going to have to participate so I can just have it on in the background while I study. Okay, so I've been doing a few questions on moment generating functions and cumulative generating functions and so far so good but now there is a team meeting. So I went to the whole team meeting. Actually, it was more than a whole team meeting. It was like a whole department office meeting. So quite a lot of people were on the call. I've done some more questions. I did take a quick break just to play with my dog a bit. I won't lie. I also went on my phone and <laughs> went on social media. But now I'm back to it. I think for this next chapter, I'm just going to dive straight into the questions and then read the notes if I struggle with the questions. Okay, so I did stop filming because I got tired, but I've been working until now and it's quarter past seven and I'm calling it a day. I'm a little bit tired now, so I'm gonna head downstairs, have dinner with my parents, watch some TV. I'm a Celebrity is on and I'm watching that pretty much every evening at the moment. I've never watched so much TV before. When I was at uni, I just didn't have time. Anyway, rounding this video up here, thank you very much for watching. Give it a like if you enjoy the study content and want to see more because I can keep it coming if you like it. I've got lots of studying to do. Um, I'm hoping to do some live study with me streams soon. Subscribe to my channel, follow my Instagram, make sure you hit the notification bell, then you won't ever miss a video of mine. <laughs> also, hope you're all doing well. Hope you're all taking care of yourselves. That's it from me. Bye. Thank you.